DIY wires. Welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Edda. Now today we're going to be doing a very special project. And if you like what I do, please subscribe, tap that notification bell, and YouTube will notify you of any and all upcoming videos. And share and comment below. I would really appreciate your comments. Okay? Well, let's get started. Come on. Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Edda. Today we're going to be painting a, an angel. I title it Angel from Heaven. Now, this is what you're going to need. You're going to need a paper towel. You're going to need some water. You're going to need a pencil. You're going to need five colors again. Okay, and the colors you're going to need is burnt umber, which is a dark brown. Burnt sienna, which is a lighter shade of brown. Mars Black, which is just a black paint. I This is a yellow Autric. It's, uh, it's kind of like a dark, deep yellow. It's not a yellow yellow. And Titanium White. And you're also going to need three brushes, okay? You're going to need a large You're going to need a small, and you're going to need a medium, okay? So you're going to need a large, medium, and small. All right, let's get started. Okay, we're going to go ahead and start on the background. But before we do, we're going to mix a peachy color. And we're going to use rust, yellow, and white. Okay, I'm going to mix it. So the rust would be the sienna, the yellow, and the white. And you mix it until you get a really peachy color, kind of like an earth tone color. Okay. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to start dark and work our way down until it gets to light. Now, without wetting your brush, now we're going to start with just the white, okay? I'm picking up a little bit of white, and I'm just going to blend it in with this. It's okay if, you know... Now, we're going to go back to the darker brown, the darker peachy brown, and we're going to mix it down. Don't wet your brush, okay? It's okay if all the paint's mixed in. It's all right. You want these earth tone colors. And then down at the bottom, we're going to do a dark brown. Just mix them, it's okay. Just blend them. Now, we're gonna get some of this just dark brown, just this one, the darkest brown, and we're gonna put it down here at the bottom. Again, without washing your brush, okay? Now, 
what we're gonna do, uh, make sure that your canvas dries a little bit so that the color that you're gonna put on next doesn't mix too much with the other one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take this paint, I'm gonna take white, I'm gonna start here in the middle, and I'm gonna make it look like it's a beam of light just shining up this way. Okay, so I'm just gonna start here, just take it and just go like that. some of this some more of this peachy color the lighter one and just blend it in with the with this because you want it to look like it's streaks of light you want it to blend in okay um just let it blend in and just don't be afraid of the color remember we don't have to be world famous artists just have fun doing this our angel we're going to use our pencil and we're going to draw the angel okay so you're going to have to envision how you want to see your angel so i want to see my angel right about here so you're going to do kind of like a little bit of a curve this is going to be the shoulders make sure that your your canvas is dry okay And then about two inches above that is going to be your head. She's going to have long hair. So I'll show you right now in a minute what I'm doing. Okay. So that you could see it better, I'm using a pen. You use a pencil, but I'll use a pen. Just so you guys could show you the line. I think you could see the lines now. I'm just gonna give her kind of like an hourglass shape. This is her shoulders. Just give her kind of like an hourglass shape. Okay, okay, now you're not going to draw anything here, but we're going to kind of like give her a little bit of a curve because her dress is going to be like, kind of like flowing down. Okay, it's gonna be like spread out. It's gonna look like very angelic. to do the wings okay um, what we're going to do is we're going to the wings are going to be really curvy that's okay you're going to cover it with paint we're going to give the wings kind of like a little bit of a curve it's going to be about couple of inches above her head. I'm gonna come around. I'm just gonna come and curve in a little bit. And then we're gonna come and make it look like 
feathers. What I did was I just uh, kind of like put some feathers in between here. See? So I did this. I just kind of made it look like there's feathers, little bit of feathers. And you can make your, your feathers however you want. Okay. Like that. Or you can spread your wings out bigger. Like if you want to do them really big. That's up to you. This is your project. You have your angel how you want to do it. Because it's your work. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and start on the body. We're going to use three colors. Brown, white, and black. Right now we're going to use the brown and the black only. Just a little bit. And we're going to start here in the back. Right here. Okay, now we're going to do brown all the way down. Don't uh, don't wet your brush, okay? We're just gonna do a little bit of brown down here. Kind of like a little bit of light brown. Okay, now a little bit with your brown, kind of coloring your hair. Okay, now we're going to do the wings. We're going to do, uh, we're going to make a gray, a light, kind of like a light medium gray, not too dark. We're going to do the wings. We're going to make a base coat for the wings. So it will give it more dimension when we get ready to, uh, to, you know, define the wings a little bit. Put more detail in there. Let's go ahead and just put some on wings. Okay, I kind of finished it, just the base coat of the wings, and this is how mine came out. Now, yours will be different from mine, uh, and that's only because that's your style of painting. Uh, everybody has their own style of painting, so don't be so hard on yourself if yours doesn't come out exactly how someone else does it, because that's not the way it's supposed to be. You're supposed to create your own style of painting, and you're experimenting, so yeah. Okay, now we're going to use uh, a, a, your big brush with a large bristle, and I'm going to use a little bit of this peachy color in the white, uh, just a little bit. And you're just going to kind of like swish it around. I'm going to add maybe you want to be able to see a little bit of the white. It's supposed to 
look like she's on a cloud, okay? Okay, now just kind of work this up to your the dress. Um, just make it look like the clouds are like flowing through her dress. And, I'm just adding a little bit more white so that it looks like she's floating up on the cloud looking up at the sky at the beautiful sunlight sun rays up high up in the clouds. Okay, now we're going to work on her hair. We're going to start with putting a little bit of white up here. Using your small brush. Okay, I started off by putting a little bit of white on her hair. Um, just a little bit. Fishy on the edges, try to blend it in a little bit. I'm going to put my darker brown down here at the bottom. Give it a little bit more like this. It's dark back here, but light up there in the front. Okay, now I just sort of measured the, a little halo, lightly drew a little white halo above. Now I'm going to draw her like a little ribbon on her hair. Um, just to give it a little bit of... a little teeny bit of white to this okay okay I'm putting a little bit of like curlies down her back for her hair um, just making it look like she has curly hair I'm adding a little bit of yellow, some brown and peach. This is her ribbon in her hair. Just come out a little bit of white. 
I'm finding out that I'm more of an impressionistic type painter. Um, Okay, now we're going to give our wings a little bit of depth. So we're going to work on our wings now. Um, we're going to give uh, our wings a little bit of, you're going to use your medium brush, which would be this one. And you're going to use, get a little bit of gray and black and brown, just a little bit. And you're just going to kind of work it in a circular motion. Mostly black and gray. So it'll be a little bit darker. Okay, now just put a, add a little bit of white and kind of make your wings look like it has a little bit of curve and depth up there. Just get some white and just kind of like stroke it up. Kind of like make the wings look like they're flowing. to make a little bit more gray. Okay, 
Okay, um... Just try to make your wings look like feathers, wings. Just really... And you just give these uh, some strokes, work these in there, just uh, layer it little by little. tiny bit black, not too much. Kind of like swoosh it up. This is just to give your wings a little bit. Okay, everyone, I'm just putting a bit, little bit, a hint of gold in your hair. It's a uh, gold paint. And maybe a little bit here in your hair.
just to give it a little bit of a glow.
angel from above, angel in the heaven. Um, you know, you can do this however you want. Just make it your own. That's what I did. I'm more of an impression, impressionistic type painter. So, yeah, just make it your own. and It's beautiful just the way it is. Okay, well, with all this being said, Keep on crafting. Tap that notification bell and YouTube will notify you of any and all upcoming videos. Okay? Alright, bye.